Getty Rafael Nadal is raring to go with the Monte Carlo Masters The most successful player in Monte Carlo history, the world number one looks for a third successive triumph at the tournament, with the first round getting underway today. Nadal does not enter until the second round, which begins on Tuesday, with the 10-time Monte Carlo winner drawn to face either El Gisbedin or a qualifier. A tricky draw could see Nadal face rival Roger Federer's Miami Open conqueror Thanasi Kokinakis in the third round, with Novak Djokovic, Dominic Thiem and Borna Choric in his pool of quarterfinal opponents. And Nadal, who has only ever lost four matches in Monte Carlo, to Djokovic, says the historic tournament, which first started in 1897, is among his favorites to compete. I always feel good when I am here, it is one of my favorite tournaments, revealed the Spaniard, who has an incredible 53 career clay court titles. Getty Rafael Nadal is a force on clay courts Getty Rafael Nadal is a 10-time winner in Monte Carlo I always feel good when I am here, it is one of my favorite tournaments. It's been a love story between me and this event. Rafael Nadal, it's been a love story between me and this event, the people who run the tournament. I saw this tournament on the TV before I started playing here and always wanted to do well. These sorts of tournaments help me to wake up in the morning and to train and compete with a lot of passion. I have won the Monte Carlo Masters 10 times, that's a good number. But one more victory, why not? The 31-year-old has not played since the Australian Open in January due to injury issues, though featured at the Davis Cup earlier this month. Nadal beat both Philip Kohlschreiber and Alexander Zarev as Spain overcame Germany. The 16-time Grand Slam champion only has a 100-point lead over Federer in the ATP rankings and cannot afford any slip-ups to remain above his longtime rival.